Weathering, erosion, and deposition cause gradual changes to landscapes. This means that these processes create landforms slowly over very long periods of time. Strong winds form sand dunes. Strong winds are able to blow grains of sand across a landscape, depositing them into the mounds that we call dunes. Running water, like rivers, form canyons. Canyons are a type of deep, narrow valley with very steep sides. Floods can also form canyons. Here you see Antelope Canyon, and this was formed as flash flooding, weathered, and eroded sandstone. Deltas form at the mouth of rivers as they deposit sediments. So as a river enters the ocean, the water slows down. This causes the sediments that are being carried away by the river to settle out of the water. Over time, this deposition of sediments builds up into a delta. Glaciers are huge masses of slowly moving ice. Glaciers move across a landscape creating a wide, U-shaped valley. So wide valleys with steep sides and rounded bottoms, valleys that have that U shape, were formed by glaciers. When soluble rock is dissolved and eroded by groundwater, a cave is formed. Now, even rocks like limestone, which can be dissolved by slightly acidic water, dissolve very slowly. So it can take tens or even hundreds of thousands of years to form a cave. Ice can also break apart rocks as it freezes and expands. Water can fill in the cracks in a rock when it rains. When that water freezes, it expands, and this can make the cracks bigger. Over time, as this process repeats itself over and over and over again, the rock eventually breaks apart. I hope this video has helped you understand the processes that create landforms a little better. Keep up the great work, and I'll see you next time.